Baby, I like your stop. Oh, what's going on YouTube? Snipes here with TKO Gaming. Having a little bit of fun there. I'm really, really happy. Uh, today was a pretty, pretty tough day. Uh, it was actually a horrible day in my book, but I got to force myself to be happy because it's okay. It's just one day in a long, long life. Um, actually, life is pretty short, but it's okay. I got to stay positive. Day's almost over, but I thought, why not make a YouTube video and talk about some crazy things that I've been reading about. Now, this isn't as crazy as like some real, real crazy stuff happening in the world at all times. So don't get me wrong. But in terms of YouTube news and like, I don't know, things that are pretty, you know, trending in the American society. I don't know if you guys have heard about it, but the Muslim brother FouseyTube he was on a trip with his friends uh, and they were at the airport and some dude stole Alex, one of FouseyTube's friends. They stole his camera. Jesus, man. First off, why steal anything? Honestly, that's just, that's stupid. That's horrible. Why you gotta steal? But it gets better. The person who stole the camera was a CEO of freaking Moji. It's a pretty big company. And I'm over here like... Last time I checked, and I am in business, CEOs make like a lot of millions of dollars. So why the hell you gotta steal an $800 camera? And if you guys don't know, the CEO's name is Oliver. I'm sure if you Google it, you guys can you know find the story in the video because FuziTube, he pretty much recorded the whole video. And man, they handled the situation really, really well. So I'll definitely give it up, give it up to them um, because I don't know how you know you know there's one thing in life where you're like you know if this happened i would act this way like if if somebody was dying i would i would risk my life and i would i would take the bullet for them i would do this now it everything is easier said than done you never know and this is the truth you never truly know how you're gonna act until you are in that situation yourself you never truly know what decision you make until you are actually in that situation to actually be forced to make that decision so it's very interesting to see how they handled it and man big shout out to alex you're a really nice guy man and you know i've always learned throughout my whole life always give people the benefit of the doubt even though they caught this dude red-handed multiple witnesses this dude alex wasabi whatever his name is man um i need to really watch more of your videos because you seriously you gave him the benefit of the doubt and even though he was com the ceo was completely in the wrong but i don't know man what do you guys think of that that's kind of crazy to me like what what do you what do you need to do and he was with his girlfriend and the whole time his girlfriend was like what are you talking about this is a two thousand dollar bag like they were really rocking the uh, louis vuitton bags and stuff and they're like oh this is a two thousand dollar bag like okay cool you got a two thousand dollar bag but why the hell are you stealing an eight hundred dollar camera for like it is just so stupid but i don't know uh at the end of the day kind of like the unity i saw with um fuzzy tube and his friends to have each other's back in that particular moment it was really it was touching like i'm sure that that that's what really meant most to them uh, out of everything so you know big shout out to them for handling the situation well tmz and perez hilton came out and just shunned that ceo um so hopefully man that there's you know there's some public lash against the ceo just to not like too much like i don't want his life to be ruined but honestly that's so petty that you even had to do that in the first place it was just i don't know that's just my opinion guys uh i want i really want to know what what you guys think of the situation let me know if you guys heard about even heard about this maybe you guys haven't even heard about it but that was one of the things and then another thing was it was this youtuber who i guess was just on the street and this guy i've never seen a video but once again you know obviously it was pretty public and a quote unquote this is what everyone's been calling them haters multiple of them they didn't like this guy apparently and they you know not only like did they pull a knife on him, but they pretty much chased him around the streets just trying to beat him up. And it wasn't a one-on-one, -on -one. it was like a six to ten people against one YouTuber who his YouTube name, he goes by like Slim or something, and yeah, yeah it's pretty pretty direct in, in hand, uh, hence that he's not actually buff or anything, he's actually pretty slim, uh, which isn't a bad thing, but it's like, yo you got 10 people trying to go up against one guy i was reading the comments and everybody was like oh man you're making he was he was arab or arab whatever you want to say um 
and you know everybody was like oh you're making us Arabs look bad like why are you running away I'm like bro there was 10 people he was literally about to get jumped not only that but he was actually going around the streets telling people hey help me you know get somebody blah 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 and and nobody was helping him I mean there was one person that ended up like this after after literally like 15 minutes of him getting chased around one person was finally like hey I'm gonna help this person out some old lady and I was just like yo come on man if I saw somebody getting jumped I would stop and help that person out like uh, once again once again I'm saying this now but in the situation who knows maybe I'm running late for an appointment maybe you know my girlfriend on the other end is getting pissed at me like oh you need to come blah 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 or to, and once again you know it's easier said than done maybe all the I'll give every one of those individuals that didn't help him out the benefit of the doubt maybe you had like I don't know a freaking turkey on the oven at home and you needed to go you know make sure that you didn't burn food because there's play people in the world that would go hungry every single day and you want to respect food i don't freaking know all right i'm gonna give you the benefit of the doubt but i mean yo just keep it keep this in mind in the future if you guys see someone that that needs help help that individual out don't just look the other way you know you would want the same for yourself there's your little message from your boy snipes thank you guys so much hope you guys enjoyed the mediocre gameplay shout out to x crazed underscore nova that's his it's his ps4 account i use this is snipes's gameplay i use his account for ps4 tournaments thank you guys for the love subscribe share the video and i'll see you guys in stream for trials of osiris all weekend long baby look in the description below for everything you need to know have a blessed day you guys peace